The other nice thing about Sanya not being here is I can have as many cigarettes as I like without getting her whinging at me. No, Charlene, uh, seriously, it's really refreshing not to have somebody counting the number of times somebody hears my lighter click. <laughs> Given what I've said about the, the notional requirements for the two-no-Trump response, if... Uh, opener shows an 11 to 15 eight trick hand with a major and a minor the assumption is is that you will always have support for the major and possibly the minor there's no guarantee which you have better support for um, but if you've only got support for one major it's unlikely that you're going to bid two no trumps. So over the eight trick hands, the only defined responses are gamma in the major or gamma in the minor. Um, for those of you who aren't OCP users, gamma is an asking bid, asking about the length and quality of uh, partner's suit. So anything other than those two bids here is totally natural and forcing. Um, but it's not anticipated that you'll ever want to do anything other than bid gamma in one of the suits. And unlike the two diamond, two spade bid, uh, where we had the gamma in both suits combined this is just a straight normal gamma in one particular suit and anything after that is either relay beta or epsilon So here's an example.
Yes, it's on. If you can't hear me. Try refreshing. So basically the two the only two defined responses are always here going to be the two cheapest possible bids um, a bid in hearts is always going to be gamma in hearts and the other cheapest bid is going to be gamma in the minor is basically how it works So over the three club and three diamond uh, rebids, three hearts is always gamma in hearts, and three diamonds or three spades is gamma in the minor that opener has shown. And I think I might have an example of this. So here, obviously, West has got seven controls with five opposite. Um, <coughs> we're going to be playing this hand in seven hearts. Uh, seven no trumps is probably making, but you can't be absolutely certain. And since East is known to have a distributional two suitor um, with only one card, or sorry, two cards in the black suit, um, seven no trumps might make, but in practice you want to be in seven hearts rather than seven no trumps.
<laughs> well, the smaller one. I suppose the smaller one might be defrosted. <laughs> uh, well, don't don't forget to run them under the tap first. It's meal day for the snake. At a warehouse, yes. Huh? When? Um, earlier on today. Killed? I don't know, don't think so.
I think if uh, if East had a void diamond rather than a uh, a singleton at this point, he would probably bid six hearts over five hearts, since clearly um, West will not be expecting a void diamond. Um, the fact that they've made the Epsilon in clubs suggests that the lack of a club control in the East Hand was actually critical um, because they won't be expecting a Void Diamond. If West had the Ace of Diamonds um, I mean, you might come unstuck if you bid six hearts with a void diamond, but in practice, you're likely to be okay. Any questions? Okay. I'm not going to uh, spend too much time on three spades. Basically, uh, it's exactly the same as the three heart rebid. It's just one bit higher. So four clubs is the inquiry over three spades, not no, three no trumps. Uh, three no trumps is just to play. So four clubs is the forcing inquiry. And again, opener is going to bid the suit below their shortage but this time four hearts shows uh, a shortage in either minor uh, four no trumps now asks which one and opener bids the suit in which they haven't got a singleton or void so they bid their fragment Any questions before we move on to the more interesting stuff? Nope. All taking your sleeping pills, I guess. Oh, I really miss Sanya at times, you know. Oh, hang on, she's here. <laughs> we were just saying how quiet it was, Sanya. And I was celebrating being able to smoke as many cigarettes as I liked without you getting on my case. <laughs> so, um, over two diamonds, two hearts, and two diamonds, two spades... Uh, the 4441 hands are split into two ranges, 16 to 19 and 20 to 23. Over two no trumps, we slightly change that. Um, the three no trump rebid is any 16 to 18 high card point 4441 hand. And as usual, four clubs asks, opener bids the suit below. Um, and then the first bid in one of the four card suits that opener is known to have is always eater and we make no preconceptions about which one of those it is but clearly there is absolutely no way um, or it's very unlikely at any rate that uh, responder will not have a fit for one of um, opener's four card suits.
and if uh, if responder is 16 plus balanced and there isn't a fit then probably four no trumps rather than four clubs will show that kind of a hand um, but the chances are that that responder will ask first with four clubs and then jump in no trumps if there is no fit but uh, responder is 16 plus balanced but that's only ever going to be if responder is 3334 three, three, and their four card suit is in uh, openers singleton any questions on the three no trump rebid I think I've got an example of that here indeed You can go and test the mice, Naomi. Have a feel of it. <coughs> okay, so the four club and four diamond rebids show the eight trick hands 
the 11 to 15 eight trick hands with a five card major and a six card minor. Sorry? Um, nearly two hours. Should be. So yeah, um, four clubs and four diamonds show the eight trick hands with that minor and spades. And once again, the two cheapest rebids over four clubs are Gamma in Opener's Suits. So this time, four diamonds is Gamma in Spades and four hearts is Gamma in Clubs. Um, you just have to remember that. There's no uh, method about it except that Spades comes first before clubs over four clubs. That's the only way of remembering it. Uh, so those are the only two defined responses as over three clubs. Um, we're always effectively assuming that responder will normally agree the major but they may have much better support for the minor and go for that instead. Uh, and again, again, we've got asking bids established here, so Relay Beta and Epsilon are available if uh, Responder needs it. I don't know if I've got a... Oh, I have. How nice. So here, um, North knows that South's got 5-6 in the black suits. So they can only have two cards in the red suits. So North's two aces will take clearly take care of them. And after that, South is able to rough. And when um, South has king-queen to six clubs the chances of not establishing, not being able to establish the clubs is remote, remote enough that you want to be in seven spades here, regardless.
And you'll notice here that over these eight trick hands, um, uh, the routine is pretty much identical on each hand. Um, that gamma in the major is almost inevitable, um, given the requirements for the the two no trump response to two diamonds. Um, if uh, if responder wants to be in game opposite any week two even it's unlikely that they won't want to agree whichever major responder sorry opener has when they've got an eight trick hand um, and because it's they've got a game forcing hand opposite a week two it's almost inevitable that we'll be pushing on towards a slam unless they've got that really distributional sort of hand that I showed at the beginning with sort of, you know, ace to five spades, ace to five hearts, you know, and a shortage in one of the minors. Unless they've got that, it's unlikely that we're not going to be pushing on to slam. So again, the two cheapest bids are the gammas, four hearts is gamma in diamonds, and four spades, evidently, is gamma in spades. Um, and I'm not going to bother showing you a hand with this. It, it's the same routine as normal. Um, any questions? Anything else apart from what I've said there? Um, so over four hearts is, is always a lower range week two. Three hearts would be the upper range one. So f now four no trumps is a mild slam try with a really strong hand. Uh, in case opener has a, uh, a useful shortage. And they would just sign off in five hearts if they didn't have one. Um, but otherwise, they bid the suit below. Um, worth noting that um, if you're going to bid four no trumps, you've got to be happy to be in slam if. Uh, opener has a club shortage because opener is going to bid five spades because five hearts is basically showing that they don't have a shortage so if uh, if a club shortage is no good to you then you don't want to bid four no trumps five hearts over four hearts is just invitational to six um, it's basically like a sort of mini Grand Slam force, but it's only interested in being in six if Opener's got two of the top three honours in their trump suit. So it's specifically asking about the quality of Opener's hearts. Again, I think I have... Maybe. No, I don't. Sorry. I don't even have an example of that. Uh, it's not very often, again, un unless Responder really has a rock-crushing hand, 
it's not often that they're going to be pushing on to uh, towards a slam if uh, if they know that opener may just have a, a really grotty five count. So exactly the same, four spades is a lower range week two in spades, and exactly the same, four no trumps is the mild slam try, uh, five spades is invitational to six if opener holds two of the top three honours. Anything else, by definition, almost, is uh, a cubid in support of spades, just as anything else apart from four no trumps and, and five hearts is a cubid in support of hearts over two diamonds, two no trumps, four hearts. I've no example hands of either of those, but uh, it's not often that Oakman's going to do anything other than pass when you when Oakman rebids four in a major. Okay, last but not least, okay, the last two um, in 30 something years of developing and playing this system, it's never happened. Um, it's in the system just in case, but in practice, yeah. the chances of Responder having a game forcing 2 no Trump bid and Opener being uh, 19 plus with a 4 4 4 1 distribution, uh, it's never happened. Theoretically, it can, um, but it's not very likely if you think about it. Um, so theoretically 4 no trumps is the strongest range that's 22 to 23 with only 4 4 4 1 5 clubs asks opener bids the suit below and then we're into eaters but in practice you might as well just bid 7 no trumps if it ever happens um, again unless the 2 no trumps is a really distributional weakish hand with good five card support for both majors and good controls but an essentially weak hand that's the only time it's likely to happen this but I, I'm not aware of it ever having happened um, I think I've even actually got a theoretical example hand of this It's worth noting the rest of the sequence is almost um, unnecessary, to be honest. Uh, it's very, very difficult to construct a 22 to 23 point 4441 hand for West, who will certainly discount any singleton honour that they have in hearts. If they've got 22 to 23 points, they pretty much have to have the hand that they do have. Um, it's almost impossible for them to have anything else. So really the five club bid 
is the only thing just to find out where the shortage is. In fact, East could bid seven, no trumps, but at teams, I think you probably want to be in seven spades here. Just in case West has miscounted their hand. Close your ears, Sonia. Okay, so the five level rebids, not for no chance, but the five level suit rebids are all showing specific 4441 hands bidding the suit below the shortage in. Uh, to be consistent with the rest of the system. <laughs> Wimp! <laughs> okay, so, so for example, five clubs would be showing a diamond shortage, five diamonds showing a heart shortage, five hearts showing a spade shortage, and five spades showing a, a club shortage. Um, and again, these are 19 to 21 points. Um, again, I'm not aware that any of these have cropped up opposite a 2 no trump response. Um, if it does, again, you just set the suit with an eater or ask, sorry, ask where the shortage is um, over 4 no trumps. But over five clubs, diamonds, hearts on spades, you don't have to because they're all showing where the shortage is. Um, so just set the suit with an eater um, and uh, relay beta if you need it but bear in mind unless you've got that kind of a really distributional weakish hand um, it's not very likely that you're going to be able to construct a hand for partner where you don't have almost everything. So almost always, if it, if it starts two diamonds, two no trumps, even, to be honest with you, even the five, even the eight trick hands it's not very often that those crop up. Um, but with all of them, the two cheapest possible bids over openers rebids are gamma in the two suits that opener has shown. And now we're into an asking bid sequence and the rest is history. Um, almost always opener has a week two when it starts, two diamonds, two no trumps.
Three more, please. Come on, don't be shy. These are all really fun hands. If you sit, you'll enjoy it. I guarantee. Come on, don't be shy. Don't be slow. Time is money. The more, the more time you think about sitting, the less time we have for practice hands. Come on, guys. It's no fun for me to play these. I think we claimed this one. Maybe not. Yes, I did claim, Roger. Certainly my claim button is... Uh, Oh, maybe not, actually. Yeah, it says 13 tricks claimed. Come on, let's have an east-west, please. Don't be slow, guys. Come on, Nuri. Get sat in there. Sanya. Oh, the hell with it. I'm not going to sit around all night waiting for you guys to decide to sit. Alrighty. Well, Nuri's been here the whole time. Don't worry, Sanya. Charlene's been here most of the time. Okay, so this is an upper range week two in spades. Uh, yes, I'll load it for you. Roger, well spotted.
So, Four Clubs asks if North has a shortage. Four Diamonds shows a heart shortage. Mehmet, don't forget this is the weak scale because you've shown a 0 to 10 or a 5 to 9 point hand with two diamonds and then three spades. So it's always, if you've shown a weak 2, it's always the weak scale that we're using. So four spades is wrong. That would show no controls. Okay, claim 11. Okay, anybody got any observations or questions on the bidding here? I've got one observation. Anybody else? Uh, well, I, that's one of my observations personally. Um, it's up to you. Seven is marginal, isn't it? But it's a really nice space suit and North does have a shortage. So I think it's reasonable to show that as upper range rather than lower range. But you could show it as either. That isn't really the problem. Um, four clubs, four clubs is not unreasonable. But bear in mind, you need south here. Really needs north to be super maximum um, for slam to have absolutely any chance at all. Um, you know, you need. For Trump solidity, you want North to have ace, the, the ace, queen, and jack of spades, just in case there's a four-one fit, uh, four-one, sorry, four-nil split. But even if you allow just the ace, queen, you then need him to have the heart shortage and the king of diamonds, because they can't have both. And if they've got a club shortage, then uh, 
you're really finished. So I'm not sure, to be honest with you, I would bother with beta four hearts here. I think I would just sign off in four spades. If you've got a nine count opposite South's 18 count, then four spades is pretty much right. You're, if you need North to have very specific cards and very specific shortages for six to have a chance, you're almost better off um, just in case something's going horribly wrong. You know, there might be a club rough in the offing, for example. Um, better to stop in four spades um, rather than risking five here. So I wouldn't have bid four hearts. I would over four diamonds. I would have said, well, that's nice. We'll just play in four spades. You could even argue just to bid four spades over three spades on the basis that it's very unlikely that North is going to have exactly the right cards for Slam to have a chance. OK, Roger, you take my point. Okay. Right, I think you lot can sit back. Always. If you show an eight trick hand, then it's the normal scale. And if you show a four 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 one hand, it's always the strong scale. Sure, nobody wants to sit east west. To you, Roger. At this stage now, for those of you that can see the west hand, um, the possibility of a 30 point deck is arising here um, because that's really the best possible response from west's point of view. If you'd shown a shortage in either black suit, I would definitely be signing off in four hearts here. But because it's diamonds, I'll just make one.
okay so um again if if east had shown up with third round control of clubs or better whether it's the queen or a doubleton or a singleton then i'm happy to go to six but uh if east has no control of clubs in other words they've got at least three small clubs now i'm looking at losing a diamond and a club trick even if they've got the king of spades then uh, that's only three tricks so I'm only going to get one club away and it's it's a matter of maths this really he's got six hearts and a singleton diamond he's got six cards in the black suits so if he's got only three clubs and he's got three spades and I'm not going to get any clubs away on the spades if he's got two spades then he's going to likely to have four clubs in which case I've got to get two two clubs away and I can only get one away so the lack of a, a club control is absolutely critical here so I'm just going to sign off in five hearts did we claim this one Roger In fact, did we lead even? Could we have a lead from south? Any questions or comments? So again, if, if East had shown a shortage in either black suit, then I'm just going to sign off in four hearts. I'm not going to bother with beta um, or I'm going to sign off in hearts at the minimum level uh, again there is a case for um, for just bidding four hearts over three hearts here because West has a dead flat uh, 17 count so opposite an upper range week two it's likely that uh, that four hearts is the limit but just in case they've got a diamond shortage and say king to four spades now we can make six hearts but he hasn't so we're stopping five Oops, I've crashed. Sorry, guys. I'll be back in a minute. My apologies. My uh, Windows client crashed, which it does do occasionally. Um, are you sitting back down, Roger? And Mehmet? Uh, no, not this hand. Sorry. Try this one.
Okay. That's thrown you, Roger, hasn't it? <laughs> yeah, but he's al <laughs> he's allowed to judge what what response he wants to make. I'm not saying I agree with it, but it's open to North to decide to bid two hearts. I wouldn't bid two hearts on his hand in a million years, but. Yeah, coming. So to hearts, two hearts is to play opposite a week two in hearts. Two no Trump shows a 16 to 19 point hand with any Three clubs is asking where the shortage is. So three diamonds shows a heart shortage. Three hearts shows a club shortage. So the problem with two hearts here, and it is a problem, is that the only beta is the only thing that north can use here now so so three hearts is beta This is using the strong scale, don't forget, Roger, because you're 16 plus. This is beta. No, this is beta. Three hearts is beta because three diamonds shows a heart singleton. Mehmet. So this this is just to play because North doesn't have a North doesn't have to have a point in his hand for this sequence. OK, the, the three, the beta suggests that he has. 
but for he has to set the final contract over the beta response that's the problem with bidding two hearts on the north hand here In practice, you're probably going to make, on a really good day, you might make six, but in practice, you're probably going to make 11 tricks here. No, you can't, Mehmet. That's the whole point. Uh, if you bid two hearts over two diamonds, there are no eaters. Because two hearts might be a Yabra. I mean, hope, I mean, everybody can see your hand now. I wouldn't bid two hearts on your hand in a million years. I'm bidding two no trumps every time. Because if partner has a weak two in spades, I want to be in game. If partner's got an eight trick hand, I want to be in game in whichever major he has, if not slam. And if he's got, well, I'm not sure they can, actually. Um, with the Ace of Hearts being on side and the King of Diamonds being in the right place for a roughing finesse, yes, they can make. And because even though the clubs are 4-1, you can catch the Jack of Clubs. But that's pretty lucky. You don't want to be in six spades. You can make six spades. But you don't want to be in six spades. It needs too much going right. If you don't get a diamond discard on the ace of, on the king of hearts, because the ace of hearts is on side. No, Mehmet, I never said anything about 14 plus. In fact, I showed you an eight trick hand. Uh, sorry, an eight point hand, with ace to five in each major, where I'd want to be bidding two no trumps. There is no point count attached to the 2 no trump bid. It's any hand that wants to be in game opposite a weak 2. That's the only criteria. And if you've got a, a three-suited hand with both majors and some controls, you want to be in game opposite a weak 2. You put any weak two opposite that north hand and, you know, the, you can construct hands where you won't make game, but it's very unlikely. Most of the time, if south has a weak two opposite that north hand, you want to be in game. It's nothing to do with north being 14 plus. This is, this is just a matter of valuing your hand correctly. Does anybody does anybody not see what I'm getting at here? If South gives South, I don't know, King Queen to six spades, and nothing, you want to be in you want to be in game here. Give him Ace Queen to six hearts and nothing else, you want to be in game. You can construct some hands where you're not going to make game, but it's not very likely. Okay. But Sanya, Sanya, you know, hand evaluation is something I can't teach you how to value your hand properly. It's just thinking, listen, if, if you know, what North needs to think about is if, you know, if South's got a weak... Yes, no, but... <laughs> That's, that's telling you how North should be thinking on this particular hand. Give him a different set of, of 13 cards and it's a whole different ball game. 
the fact is, when you've got a three-suited hand, you know, a 4-4-4-1 four, 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 hand with a shortage in a minor and four card support for both majors and five controls, yes, of course you want to be in game opposite a week two. And the way, the way to bid it is to bid two no trumps because now you find out. And if partner shows a minimum week two, you can just pass it because they're going to be rebidding four hearts or four spades. If they bid three hearts or three spades showing a maximum week two, again, you just bid game. And if they show an eight trick hand, you can come alive and start asking questions. If they show a strong four, 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 one, likewise. Yes, you can. I'll just, I'll just send the hand again. But do you see what I'm getting at, everybody? There's no point count attached. Put it this way, if South opened, if supposing you weren't playing, supposing you were playing two over one or standard American and you were sat with that North hand and part, partner opened a week two in hearts, what would you bid? You bid four hearts every time. Well, I bid four hearts every time anyway. Similarly, if partner opens two spades, I'm going to be bidding four spades. If that's the case, you need to be bidding two no trumps over over an OCP two diamond bid. That's that's what I'm saying. Right. So now we should get a three no trump rebid from South to show the sixteen to eighteen sixteen to eighteen point four 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 one hand. So now there is an eater bid available. But you have to go to four to four clubs first to find out where the singleton is. Yeah. That's the point. Two no Trump shows some values. If North had a Yarborough, they wouldn't be bidding two no Trumps. So now four diamonds shows a heart shortage. Now Eater, yes, Eater. Set the suit. You can't in practice do anything else because the, f the first bid you make in one of South's suits is Eater. It's not a sign-off. So, so four spades is Eater in spades. So now, effectively, you're going to be forced into six spades.
Okay, and I mean, I said before, you don't really want to be in six bait here. But in practice, the system is, is pushing you there. And in fact, on these cards, you're going to make it. Especially on a lead of the ten of spades. It doesn't matter what the ten of spades is a lead from. You're either going to make a heart trick or you're going to get a diamond discard. And now you've a chance of six spades when West has the King of Diamonds. You just draw trumps. The only thing that's going to stop six spades here is East having the King of Diamonds. Or West having Jack to four clubs. Jack nine to four. Any questions? So at least we had the right sequence here. Okay, so on this one, you can you can say it's a lucky make, but the fact is, if you're not playing a multi, if you're playing a week two, and East opened a week two in hearts, you would bid four hearts on the West Hand, probably. Or you would make some kind of inquiry sequence. Indeed, OCP is probably... The simple OCP system is probably better here because you're going to get two hearts, two spades inquiry. Have you got a shortage? Um, East will show a diamond shortage and now four hearts. So we don't have that luxury with the two diamond opening. You just have to hope that East has got a shortage somewhere and that it's not in spades. Any questions?
you're not supposed to see the east hand now. You can do. You can do if you want to, uh, Mehmet. You really want to come in at the three level with your powerhouse two pie card point hand. I don't think so. <laughs> no, he really doesn't. You're vulnerable here. Oh. You can't compete with these West Hands here. Okay. If you weren't vulnerable, Mehmet, go for it. Over the three club bid. But you don't know that partner's got support for you. If partner has got a singleton diamond, three diamonds is going to be calamitous.
What? Whoosh! Eat, eat, eat. Whoosh! Got in the mud or couldn't work out how to eat it. Name me fix it up. Offers it to him again. Whoosh! Mouth gone. Excellent. Within about five minutes. Good, good, good. Both. <laughs> For those of you who are wondering what that conversation was about, we've got a, a royal python. He's a bloody ball python. Ball python, if you like. And uh, was tonight was feeding feeding time at the zoo. So here... Tell um, me, was that hungry? He nearly took my fingers off. <laughs> so here, three hearts. Negative nine. Why? Why negative nine, Mehmet? I've got. Hang on, five, six, seven, eight. I've got fourteen top tricks in seven no trumps. How are you going to stop seven no trumps? You might be negative nine if I allowed you to play in seven diamonds, but I'm going to bid seven no trumps every time. Well, I don't know about negative nine. You're going to make... You're going to lose three spades, four, five, two hearts, and a club, and a diamond. One, two, three. Oh, no, you're not. Sorry. No, no spade rough. You're going to lose two spades, two hearts, the Ace of Diamonds and a club. But the thing is, you don't know that the East, what you don't know what kind of a hand East has. They could be sat there with Ace, King, Jack to five diamonds, in which case now you probably are going to be nine off. <laughs> It's rather a lot. It's rather a lot, Sanya. The fact is, you know, on this two count in the north hand, they're not going to come in. You might double three diamonds. You might double two diamonds to say, hey, I've got diamonds. The trouble is, if you're playing Dixon, the double doesn't say that. It says I've got a 11 to 15 point takeout of a major. But more likely, you're going to pass, find out what they've got, and then come in. But you're not going to come in on a two count. That's just fantasy. Not at this vulnerability. Okay, any other questions about this hand? Before we move on, because we've got time for one more hand. Well, you can get too busy. You know, think even remotely thinking about coming in with an overcall on a two count at the three level, vulnerable. Even if partner's got a fit. Just ain't just it's just madness to even think about it. And bear in mind that most people don't have the system to get to seven no trumps there. A lot of them will stop in game. Now what's the point in going off 1400 for minus four vulnerable when ops are going to stop in 620 or 680 or 7, 710? 
going off 1400 just not worth thinking about okay so here we have an eight trick hand with diamonds and spades in the north hand so four hearts would be gamma in diamonds four spades is gamma in spades Okay, so now we've got spades agreed. And we can be fairly sure the spades are solid when uh, North has two top honours in spades. Um, actually, Roger, this is, this is relay beta. It's not epsilon. This is relay beta. You know, you just need to change the alert. So again, the normal scale, because North has shown an 11 to 15 hand. So uh, five controls and that tells Roger quite a lot actually um, because Roger can tell we're only missing one control and it's likely to be the king of hearts But it's not impossible for North to have ace to six diamonds and king x in heart. That's not impossible. But there's an easy and cheap way to check. But in practice, anything that South does to check at this point means going to seven spades so in practice south can't afford to ask here so you have to go with the the likelihood is is that he's got ace to king to six diamonds an ace queen to five spades no no, you want to be in Grand Slam here, Roger. You don't want to be in six spades. If he's got ace, king to six diamonds, what are the chances that you're not going to be able to establish the, the diamonds? I'm betting seven spades anyway. If the spades are 2-2, two, two, you can cope with four two diamonds. If the spades are three three, you need something nice to happen in diamonds. Either three three split or whatever. But there's too many chances for for seven spades to be making here. Even if he turns up with the king of hearts, king x of hearts and a void club, 
you've too many chances to establish the hearts. So three, three diamonds, the queen of diamonds coming down in two rounds. It's too good. When you look at that north hand, you want to be in seventh spade. And as it happens, the queen of diamonds is a doubleton. So claim your 13. If you play this in uh, in six spades, then there's basically something wrong with the system that you're playing. You know, if you're playing, you expect you expect people to miss a grand slam if they're playing standard American or two over one. But uh, when you're playing OCP, you expect to get to a grand here. Okay, guys, it's midnight. I'm about to turn into a pumpkin. So if anybody's got any questions on the two no Trump responses. Say again, Mehmet. Not quite sure what you're getting at, Mehmet. All ah, right, okay. All righty, guys. Um, thanks for coming.